Uh, anodes are really, really cr crusty and corroded, so those will need to be changed. This is the, where you get to the anode from the, for the Yamahas. Right, take off this little plastic plug, or rubber plug. Ooh, this one, so corroded that stuck to the uh, anode. I can feel the threads getting stuck on the bolt where it's not gonna come off as nice as I'd like it to. But before we put a new one on, you always gotta get those bolts cleaned. And if you can't clean the bolt, get all the metal off of it, then you'll have to buy a new one. But there's a, well, yeah, this thing is pretty corroded. This is pretty bad. Yep, so this is what it's supposed to look like. So um, it's these two middle bolts. Take a look at the uh, take a look at the bracket. These two middle bolts come out, not the sides, not the sides. Okay, for this particular model. Um, ooh, nice and slow with the impact. So and take this one off. All right. So what I'll do is put this on here. All right, I'll start it and then it goes into a little spot. Now don't forget, you need to put the tether on here. This is the bonding wire. The bonding wire is the whole purpose of these anodes. There's that one and tighten it. This bonding wire, see how it bonds to the trim motor and the trim and tilt? It keeps all the corrosion and it focuses on here. Instead of this corrosion being in this thick salt, being on your trim and tilt, it's, it's on this sacrificial metal. So that's why these are pretty, these are very important.